Hey everyone, okay, so it's hard to think that almost, well, exactly two years ago, um, I released the collection which was my brush collection. Um, and it is hard to believe it was two years ago. It is so strange. When I released the collection, it was, let me kind of give you a quick overview. The, uh, in case you don't know, the brushes themselves were, the, the shapes and the sizes were all designed by me. And the whole thing, the whole brushes, everything is funded by me. There's no one else doing it for me. I'm not making a percentage or anything from somebody else. It's just my name on something. This whole project is run by me. And it's important that you know that because I was, I'm so passionate about brushes. If you've watched me for any time, you'll know that, that these brushes had to be perfect. They had to be very specific. They had to be handmade. They had to be made in Japan by artisans. It takes over 20 people to make a single brush. So, you know, everything about them, the softness of these is unlike anything you've ever felt before. So that's why I was so, you know, specific about it and why, you know, I'm so proud of it. When the brushes, when the collection was originally released two years ago, it sold out worldwide within five minutes. It was just phenomenal. Um, so to celebrate two years that it's been released, um, I am now re-releasing the collection again, but this time there are some gorgeous amendments to it. So let me talk you through it. So originally in the collection, the first brush, brush number one, is a foundation brush, which is this short angled brush that you can use to press your foundation into the skin to create a poreless look. So this is brush number one. But for the collection, the two year anniversary, I have increased the size of the brush. It's four times the size now of brush number one, the original. So there you go, you can see it's four times the size. And this is, for, this is a limited edition brush. Once it's gone, it's gone. So it's double the size, four times the size, so you can really either work it like this to create that flawless, poreless look, or use this to, when you've contoured and highlighted, to stipple and blend and push all the product into the skin to create that dimension. So this is so cool. Um, also to kind of celebrate the anniversary, um, the, it, my name, everything is lasered into these, and it's lasered in like a bright fuchsia now, which is really, really cool. So this is the new brush number one, which is limited edition. So brush number two, in case you're not familiar, is a domed brush that I use to powder, sculpt, highlight, contour, apply blusher and bronzer with. It's a small dome brush. It is ultra soft. You've no idea until you feel them. It is just like silk. So you can use this to highlight the cheekbones, to contour. If you apply more pressure, you can use it to apply your bronzer. Again, more pressure, you can use it to apply your blusher with. And I like to use it to apply powder to the T-zone area, underneath the eyes, down the sides of the nose. So it's perfect for that. It's, it's truly a beautiful brush. Brushes number three and four. Now brushes three and four are here. You have a crease, two crease brushes in different sizes. So you have the number three, which is this one here, is the thicker of the brushes. And then you have brush number four, which is slightly skinnier, like a skinnier version. Both of these can be used to apply color all over the lid, up to the brow as an all over wash, directly into the crease of the eye, or to blend out your eyeshadow however you choose. So, you know, like brush number four is perfect for my eye because I don't have a very large eye, whereas I use brush number three to apply all over colors mostly um, and to blend. So you can kind of pick and choose. Brush number three is also great to apply powder to specific parts of the face as well as highlighter. So that's great. Now, originally in the collection, brush number five is this one, this gorgeous little tiny baby crease brush. However, I wanted to make a change and I wanted to make a permanent change because I listened to a lot of the feedback. So I wanted to create another brush that was just as good, but better. So brush number five in the original collection is now permanently gone and is replaced with this. This is brush number five now, is a very, very small pointed eyeshadow brush. So it's like a mini crease brush or a mini kind of smudger brush. It is absolutely tiny. The reason for this is, first of all, you can get to the lower lash line and it's so small that you don't have, you haven't got this really kind of, you know, thick um, smudger brush where 
it's bringing the colour down too low. You can go as low as you want with this or as fine as you want with this. Great for the inner tear duct. For those of you who really like to kind of etch out that, um, you know, cut crease, you can absolutely do that with this. We're getting the most precise crease action. It's just the most beautiful brush because it is so small. You know, most of us don't have really large eyes, so we were able to smoke out shadow here right at the lash line without it going up too high. So this is the new brush number five. Okay, brush number six. Now many of you will kind of know the kind of shape of this. It looks very, very similar to a MAC 217, except it's different. First of all, the material is totally different. This is beyond soft, absolutely soft. This can be used to apply color all over to the lid or up, but it's really a blending brush. It's so soft. Because of the shape of it, you can blend in into the crease. You can blend in a more sort of linear motion, but because it's got that angle to it, it's excellent for blending and extending eyeshadow up and out. You can also use this to apply your liquid concealers to um, underneath your eye and to set the concealer as well if you choose. Brush number seven is like a really small baby eyeshadow brush, like a flat eyeshadow brush. It's absolutely tiny. First of all, great for tear duct work, great for lid work if you don't have much room. Yes, you'll take a little bit longer, who cares? Perfect for um, the brow, you know, the arch of the brow to highlight because this will give you a tiny amount of color there as opposed to that real strong sort of stripe of color. This brush is also excellent. You can absolutely go through your brows with it, 100%. It's the most amazing lip brush. Because of the shape and size of it, you can just get right in to the outside corner, lay it flat and pull, and you get the perfect line. And finally, the holy grail of all eyeliner brushes, brush number eight. I, I, I hang on while I get the Hubble telescope in to see it. It is the smallest brush you've ever seen. It's a flat, small, soft, push liner brush designed specifically to give you the darkest, blackest lashes possible without giving you that overlined effect. There are, most people have normal shaped eyes, whereas if you suddenly draw a black line across it and you open your eyes, all you see is the black line. With this, you can push black eyeshadow into the lash line from this upper part and the lower part. It will make your lashes look thick and black and dark without taking away any lid space. That's what it was for. It is probably one of, it is almost certainly one of my one of my favorite brushes because there's nothing else like it because it's that tiny and small and it just works exactly as it says on the tin. So, just to have a little recap. That, my friends, is the collection, the anniversary collection. Now, all the information is in the description bar. Um, where to buy them and all the rest of the stuff and it ship, we ship worldwide everywhere it, they go everywhere so if you're in a country and you're saying does it ship here it ships everywhere but all the information in the description bar again I want to thank everybody that has bought the collection and who will continue buy the collection it is it, you know it is a labor of love it is my business and it is funded by me every single aspect of it is run by me and I want to thank you all for helping me achieve this and of course the Beautylish who stock and sell these exclusively. They are an absolute dream to work with uh, and the best customer service ever. So there you go. Thank you so much. And again, information down there. And I will see you all soon. Bye-bye.